So tournaments versus camps. So I talked about uh, the size and format uh, question and really the benefit of a camp, you know, over a tournament sometimes is it's played on one field or one court. Um, you know, it's more of a focused, smaller group of people. Um, you know, it's often allows for enough individual showcasing to happen. So there's no worry about exposure. Uh, the challenge uh, with tournaments is a lot of different fields. Um, you know, you don't know the schedule and if you're going to be on fields where college coaches are at. The benefit of tournaments is typically it draws a lot more college coaches to it. Um, but either or, literally, you got to be on that scouting list, you know, before that event uh, to really get and maximize the type of interest. Uh, from those coaches, um, and whether it's a tournament or a camp, because average tournament, let's say for a sport like soccer, might be, you know, eight to 15 fields. Same thing with baseball. Sometimes they're that big, and softball the same. Um, and there might be, you know, 50 coaches, college coaches. There might be 100. There might be 200, but they might be all focused on certain fields and. Again, they're going into that camp with a clear agenda of who they want to see. So it's very, very important that, uh, you know, those coaches uh, are building that scouting agenda and your child is on that agenda. Um, and there's a couple ways to kind of guarantee, you know, that that, that can happen. Um, you know, the ability to work with coaches is going to happen more at a camp, um, you know, than a tournament or a showcase. Um, the camp can be a big benefit too because you get to visit the campus um, and again the evaluation and then the cost and the value all need to be evaluated because both of them have their advantages.